name is Nanin Teshuizi, and I'm from Secondary 1 Splendiferous. I am 13 years old. As I grow up, I've come to know that my life is not always successful, peaceful, happy, or easy all the time. There have been times of failure, disorder, sadness, or difficulty. However, I'm still here, still growing physically. Even with the existence of those failures, disorders, sadness, or difficulties that I don't want to have in my life. But both of my parents, especially my mom, always trust in me and encourage me to try my best. Not to focus on the results, but to, you know, give it a best shot. Mom always said, if you try your best, you would never regret. Those precious words of my mom changed my mindset. As my mindset has changed, not only my educational life, but my social life has changed as well. The way I learn things has changed too. I can even learn from my mistakes, errors, and failures instead of feeling down and out. For instance, I participated in the spelling bee contest starting from the third annual contest to the seventh annual contest. Throughout my participation, there have been times I failed to get any prizes, or just get minor prizes. Then, with the encouragement of my family, I kept on trying and became a champion. From that time on, learning spellings for new words is not a problem for me at all. As for Chinese Character Writing Hero Contest, Chinese Myanmar Friendship Program, and Chinese Master Contest, I felt so stressful and thought it was so difficult and I could not do it at all. But at the same time, I wanted to challenge myself and try my best no matter what the result would be. To my amazement, I won second runner up in the fourth annual contest and the best handwriting in the sixth annual contest of the Chinese character writing hero. I was also granted a scholarship in the Chinese Myanmar Friendship Program while I was in P6. And I also became the first runner-up in the fourth annual Chinese Master Contest. I gained more confidence in learning Chinese from that moment on. As you all know, because of COVID-19 outbreak, we all have to stay home for more than two months. But our school, BrainWorks Toto International School, has introduced us with online learning and how to design our learning style with our growth mindset. That makes us become a responsible person. Our lives have become full of learning activities again, though I had some awkward moments with online learning at first. The school also facilitates us with things we need to support our online learning and make it systematic. Now, I take my own responsibility to organize my bookshelf and that motivates me to organize my wardrobe and that in turn motivates me to help my mom doing chores. As said previously, my social life has also changed to some extent. When I was younger, I just wanted to keep everything for myself. But my parents and my grandparents show good examples of sharing and caring for other people. Through their examples, I feel inspired to share whatever I can with those who are in need, with elderly persons and friends. As I practice sharing things with people, I felt warmth of love from those people, and my heart was overwhelmed with joy. I believe the warmth of the love and the joy that I gain are even more valuable than those things I share. As we all know, life is so full of ups and downs. But with the mindset that developed in me, life would be so full of fun and exciting like riding a roller coaster. And every day would be a nice day for me. Thank you all so much for your time and listening. Wish you all have a nice day.